What's going on? What's happening? I need a costume. For Halloween. Oh. Wait, to me, please. Please wait. What do you want, Dave? Look, I know we've had our differences. There was a thing with the bird. That time I almost fired you. But now I need you. But not you, because that would be dis inappropriate. What I'm trying to say is I need your help. Why should I help you? <sighs> Janine, because that's the kind of person you are. You're, you're nice, and you help people and stuff. What did you need again? I need a costume for a Halloween party. I've got it. I've got an idea. I could even borrow my father's old costume. Yeah? What is it? Only the greatest entertainer ever. Cher? No. Then who? Charlie Chaplin. Who? What? Charlie Chaplin. You don't know Charlie freaking Chaplin? Okay, Janine, just calm down and listen to me. This is a terrible idea. I, I need something else. Something better. Then I don't know what to tell you. Janine! <sighs> terrible idea. Hi. Oh my god, can't you knock? I I did, but uh I brought I have your coffee for you. Sir. Oh, give me a coffee. You know, I take you in. I give you an internship. You know, I let you be my assistant. I make you my right hand man. I just don't feel like you appreciate me. What the hell is this? Uh, coffee? Is it? Is it? Is it, the, is it the coffee that I asked for? No, I asked for sucralose, and you gave me aspartame. You ever tried aspartame, Ranger? It's Ranger. No. Aspartame tastes like what I would imagine yak urine tastes like. Here, would you like to try some? I'm sorry, you can't. I don't hate you that much. Jack? What? A oh, good afternoon to you too. I need you to take a look at these when you get a chance. <sighs> Fine. Who the hell is that? Uh, Roger something. No, it's uh, it's Ranjin, Santa Ranjin, sir. I'll ask you again. Who the hell is that? He's my assistant. Are you out of your mind? Well, I'm sorry, but I couldn't keep dealing with Angie, and since somebody wouldn't let me fire her, I decided to bring in some middle management. A liaison between you and your secretary is not middle management, and you were at no time given the okay to hire someone. Where is his paycheck coming from? I don't pay him money. Just good old-fashioned life experience. What? He's an intern. I get him for three months, and the best part is that he can't quit because it's for school. Wonderful. Look, I just need you to read through Hey! This. Where the hell was my lunch? Uh, well, I, I was- You were gonna, what? I was gonna get it from- I've been no. sitting in the car for 20 minutes. Why were you sitting- No. Why are you here? Well, Ranjin, remember how you're supposed to waltz on in here and get my lunch from the fridge? Why would your lunch be in our fridge? And why are you using my assistant? I thought we could share. No. We can't. Okay, Randy, intern, out. Out! Oh, Jesus, come on, guy. Look, I gotta head out, pick up a costume for the party. Could you please, please try to get some work done while I'm gone? Yeah, I could get a lot more work done if, say, I had someone to assist me. Work. <sighs> this sucks. No, no, it's good. It's just the jacket that doesn't fit. <sighs> I guess I could take it in. Not really. My dad wears this every November to the Charlie Chaplin Film Festival in Woolworth. Where's that, New York? Yeah. Look, you can just wear it like this or get another black suit jacket. But all I have is a brown one. You don't own one black suit jacket? <sighs> well, there was this one thing with the goose. Whatever. Brown should be fine. They shot in black and white anyway, so who knows what color the jacket was, really. Alright. Hey, 
Janine, thanks. Sure. Hey, uh, one last thing. I tried to look this guy up on the internet, and there was no talking but and music only. So what does this guy sound like? Hmm. Janine. All I'm saying is if you want to ask her, ask her. It's not that easy. Why not? She might not even be single, okay? And how do I even know if she's interested? She's interested. Oh, really? Yeah, huh? Okay, that's not even the point. I, I don't, I, I can't go around hitting on everybody that comes in here. I can't hit on all my clients. First of all, she's my client. Secondly, I'm pretty sure I've seen you asking out, dating, sleeping with many of your clients. You watch me sleep? All the time. Whatever. She's different. She just seems different. <laughs> you do like different. But what the hell is that supposed to mean? Let's just say you've dated some interesting people. Like who? Sari. All right. Sari, she worships rocks. She's not the only one out there that does that, okay? Right, okay. When Amy comes in tomorrow, you're gonna ask her to the party. No excuses, all balls. Delightful. It's the last minute party, Halloween, Friday night, people from work will be there, some other, man. Mom, I put herself together here. Come on, you run a successful business, you're a good guy. She may be single. Let's do this. The two of us, let's go out Friday night. There's a Halloween party going on. Some people from work, some friends. It'll be a great time. I feel, you know, we'll go. We'll just have a blast. Are you free? <laughs> so is this going to be like a costume party or more of a, you know, casual party? But, but is it Mitch? Yeah, you're still here? Yeah. No, it's... I'm asking this girl out. Oh, 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 say no more, I get it. Okay. You're a wingman, right? No. Mitch. Mm -hmm. I'm a guy. Yeah? I'm gonna ask this girl out to a Halloween party from, you know, from work. Okay, don't worry, you don't have to be shy. Okay. I'll go with you, not a problem. You know, you can, you can go with your girl and, and I'll go with your friend. <laughs> So, Ranjan, I was taking an intro to psych class, and there was this beautiful hot chick, all right? We were talking, you know, we were hitting it off great, having a grand old time. Turns out, she's in the wrong class, and this 500-pound gorilla sits right down in her place. Mm -hmm. so, so what'd you do? Me? I left. Never looked back. <laughs> you know, Ranjan, college, it's just not for everyone. I'm more of a, a free spirit anyway. The hell is going on in here? Hey, Jack. Um, well, he, we were just talking and then he just sat down. For, did I uh, ask you? Actually, you kind of did. <sighs> Randy, we need to talk. Um, what? What? This? This is a place of business. Not a place for you and my intern to come hang out. Shoot the old breeze. Come on, uh, we were, we were just waiting for no, you. No, Randy, you weren't. You were taking advantage, just like you always do. Oh. Let's go. Let's go hang out at Jack's office. My my cool older friend with the awesome job and the fantastic hair and the flawless complexion. No, Mr. Sanders, it wasn't really his, his fault. It was... In you. <laughs> oh, you. Let's talk about you for a minute, shall we? Jack. No, 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 no. Let's talk about you for a second. I take you in. Make you part of the family, like some sad, malnourished dog with bad hygiene. And how do you repay me? Huh? You take a proverbial crap on daddy's rug. What are you, what are you gonna do next, huh? Are you gonna lick your ass and then lick my face? Dude. No. Well, all right then. Randy, you're out. Oh, come on, man. Suspended from visiting this office for one week. Oh, man. In you. Since you can't seem to get any work done while you're here, why don't you take this and go pick up my Halloween costume and get out of here. Yes, sir. Don't you think you kind of went a little overboard? No, Ed. You don't understand their kind. Interns. Overboard. 
I just hope I didn't go underboard. Got this. It's a man. Uh, tie, jacket, shirt, mustache, hat. I need the hat. Uh, the closet here. Uh, uh, it's a stupid closet. Hey, Jack. Randy. Oh, I got your costume. And I have an apology. Please, come in. No. I never should have blown up at you the way I did, Randy. It's just, I walked into my office, and I saw you with that kid, and I just, I hate him so much. I know, Jack, I know. Me too. Friends? Friends. No, no. That's... Hey, Jack, what's the costume? <laughs> Only the best costume ever. I searched for this thing for like three months. This is seriously the best cost... What the f*** is this? A guillotine, a gift for Halloween. Dragon wings, ghoulish things remind me of you. Dude, just come out. No. Come on, man, I saw it. It's not that bad. You knew what was in the bag? Yeah, yeah, I did. I just figured you were going for something edgy. Jack, you can't stay in the bathroom all night. There's people here with liquids. Jack? Wow. There it is. That intern is dead. It's not that bad. It's quite becoming. You son of a bitch! <laughs> hey guys, I'm Mitch! Nice costume! Hey Mitch! Move! So, I've been working out down at Matt's gym. That's how we became such good friends. And I have to say, it's great to finally be a part of the group! Oh, I get it. The friend is here. What? No, no, dude. Oh, where is he? I mean, she didn't do anything wrong. She said she would try. She's probably just busy. But it was on purpose. What? Nah, you think? Look at him. Over there laughing. Smiling, having a great time. I bet he's been planning this for months. He's only known you three weeks. <laughs> That's what I'd like you to believe, Matt. <sighs> bet there's more of them. Interns waiting to take me down. Watch my empire crumble. Dude, what the hell are you talking about? I don't know. I've seen you at the gym. Huh? I'm Mitch, Matt's friend. Oh, hey, I'm Jordan. He told me all about it. You're Amy's friend, right? I... I guess. I mean, I train her, but we get along well, though. Yeah! So... Yeah... I bet I know what you're thinking! Yeah? You're thinking, how did I get into this shape? Well, it took a long time. I'd assume so. Ah, oh, must be Dave. Right on an hour late. Hi, guys! Dude! Guess who I am? Wow. What?
Why do we have this party? To escape our otherwise boring and meaningless lives. Hmm. How's your arm? It's a little sore, but the bleeding stopped. I don't think the cut was too deep. Well, considering how many people you will have offended by the time the story makes the rounds, I think you got away pretty easy with a nice little scratch there. I swear I had no idea! Oh, uh, we know, Dave. We know. Seriously, it was Janine! She knew! She knew this would happen to me! Yeah, well, at least she dressed you as a male, no matter how horrible he was. Actually, I'd rather be dressed like this.